Hi everyone. So today I have the um wait. I want to say this is the Glow Attic Beauty Box for May because I already did April's, but it still says Shop I Beauty. They must just use the same. I don't know. Oh yeah, okay, this is Glow Addict for May, so, um, and I don't have a, this is my second box from them, they don't have a, um, card in here either, I don't know what this is, 15, 20, I don't know what this is, and of course I don't have my... I just opened my April Beauty Box from Chef Eye Beauty, which is a sister company. I think this one might be 20, and I think that one might be a little bit cheaper or something, 23 or something like that. Oh, this is a brush. Huh, actually, I kind of like it. So it's just a little... It's really kind of cute, actually. And then... These are the same. Wait a minute. Oh, okay. So the ones I got are Indica that came in the eye beauty bag for April and the ones I'm getting in this one for May is Sativa. Uh, they really look pretty similar to me. But like I said in my unboxing for eye beauty, I don't wear lashes anyways. I don't wanna keep getting them in these both boxes every month. So whatever, I don't know, but whatever, blah, blah, blah. And then we have another Naked Cosmetics Sluice Pigment. So, same thing, just a different color. Just, and then Ocalon Mild Black Liquid Eyeliner, which I just got a black liquid eyeliner in that box, which came light, so, I don't know. And then we have an Ocalon 24 color eyeshadow palette, perfect stylus eyes. Let's see, can I get this open? Maybe not. I don't know, I don't think I've ever heard of Ocalon, have you guys? <sighs> Come on. I don't want to rip the box because I really save all the boxes to all my palettes. I want to do like a collage or something one day. And plus if I don't keep it and donate it, I want it to still be new. Okay, this is not opening. I did rip it anyways. All right. <clears throat> it does say this is made in PRC, but it's distributed by Ocalon Cosmetics in Los Angeles. I don't see anything about it being cruelty free or vegan or anything, so I'm guessing it's not. Oh my God, I can't even get it out. Uh, like really? Okay, there we go. Oh, this is pretty cool. It's actually, 
has a blush, a contour, a highlight. There's no mirror, but um, there's all that in there. I wonder how this performs. Any of you guys know? Well, let me know if it's any good. I don't necessarily want to start sticking my fingers on it. If it's going to be hard to work with because I'm not very patient with eyeshadows. I like the ones that just go on and good to go. I'm not even going to try and close that because I'm never going to get it open again. Okay, so that was the Glow Attic box for me. You guys stay safe and I will see you later. Subscribe below if you like and have a good day.